And welcome back. To Nash Beyond the Bell. I think it's day 68. Okay. I'll take your word for it. <laughs> All right. So today, um, we were watching Entertainment Tonight. And Meryl Streep said that her and her husband have been living apart for six years. And just like Will and Jada said, they have been living apart for six years. Or separate lives for six years. And, you know, I think, you know, people have issues with this. And... Um, comments about this and I guess some people say well why don't they just get a divorce and so I just sort of want to take a gander at why I would think that some people don't get a divorce when they've been married for a really long time especially as they get older well <clears throat> I guess it depends I mean you know there could be a lot of uh, complications or to use a Jada's term, entanglements, and I don't mean fellas right. on the side. Gotcha. Um, you know, there may be a lot of investments. Um, there still could be a lot of love yeah. between the two, mm -hmm. um, but for whatever reason, they just don't believe that they work in a love relationship that way. They could still be really great companions and friends mm -hmm. um now i'm just taking a stab in the dark here as far as what your question is because the reality is this for me mm -hmm. i don't understand it right. uh, if you're gonna be together work do the work mm -hmm. and if you really believe that there is no amount of work that can keep you together then um, I, I, I don't understand it. And, and I guess for me, um, I wouldn't say that I don't understand it. I mean, I guess sort of for me, it's a little bit different because what I take away from it <laughs> is that maybe someone feels like they need to do their own personal work and they need to pull themselves together. And like you said, together, they're not really successful but at the same time, especially as you get older, you know, you really, in my opinion, um, think about, you know, if I'm going to end this relationship, am I looking to get into another relationship or is that the reason why I'm ending it? But is it a form of tolerating, though? You know, because I thought back to the story of us mm -hmm. with, um, uh, who was it? Um, the woman from... Um, <laughs> Michelle her mm -hmm. thank you and bruce willis mm -hmm. and there's a scene where because they are contemplating divorce right. and then there's a scene mm -hmm. where they just kind of like she breaks down and she mm -hmm. was like you know she wants this right you know because it's like a dance that you perfect mm -hmm. and, right. mm -hmm. and i mean they know each other so well mm -hmm. and even though the things that bother them about one another they would have to get acclimated to somebody else's stuff that would bother them and all that kind of stuff mm -hmm. Um, so is it a convenience in some way? Mm -hmm. well, you know, it's too much work to begin anew. And it, that but, could but, be but, it. But, 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 but. That could be it. You really are not totally invested <laughs> in what you have. And see, that's the way I look at it. <clears throat> if you're going to be in, be all in. Do the work. Do what you have to do so that you can move forward in a healthy way. And maybe that's the healthiest that it can be. Yeah. But also, it could be a situation where, like I said, you know, right now they're trying to get themselves together. And if you still love somebody, sometimes you need that separation. Sometimes you need that space in order to sort of grow. Now, for me, personally, if I was still married to somebody, I really wouldn't be out dating or sleeping with other people because um, I'm still married to that person. So, yeah, how does that work if, you no work, way, if no. you're working on your relationship? No. Mm -mm. But, you know, I mean... Well, I mean, because legal, for me, as a Christian, I'm still married to you. Right, so, if I'm right. working on myself, then that's me working on myself. That doesn't have anything to do with... Um, the other part, you know, it doesn't have anything to do with sex or dating. Or that's if I'm not mm -hmm. working on that. If I want to date, then I need to get a divorce. But, you know, if I'm in a relationship and I feel like this is a person that I want to spend the rest of my life with, I just need a break right now. I just need some time to, to pull myself together or to grow in a different, you know. But see, when you pull other people in, right. then there is just more confusion. Yeah. And you're pulling people into your mess. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? If, if... 
if you're going to stay, then be fully present. Yeah. That's my take on it. Mm. And by being fully present, do what you need to do so you can do what you want to do with your spouse. Yes. Until tomorrow, if the Lord says the same. Have a good evening.